Hey guys, Rorius here. Welcome to Fran Bo. So, today starts the first day that I'm recording the first of the Halloween special things. <laughs> so I thought I'd play Fran Bo. I've heard this is a great horror, like, it's like half cute, half horror. Uh, I want to play Little Misfortune, which is made by the same developers. But I wanted to play this first, so we'll probably play this now in October, and we'll play Little Misfortune in November, or sometime after October. So, never seen anyone play this before, I've seen little tiny bits of it. So for me, relatively speaking, this is going to be a new experience, I'm not going to know anything about it. <laughs> this game uses an autosave feature, sure. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. Oh god. Already, like, ugh, freaky. I see my parents. They look happy. They have a present for me, I wonder. Oh, I wonder. <laughs> Sorry, they have a present for me. I wonder. It's a cat. So sweet and pretty. Dark as the deepest night. It's Mr. Midnight. My best friend. My only friend. We're having dinner, and I see Aunt Grace too. I really like—I really like her a lot. Get the mouse as far off the screen as possible. It's Friday. My parents are going out. Aunt Grace takes good care of me. We are having so much fun. It's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. But something feels really bad. A strange creature outside my window. I don't like it. It scares me. Suddenly I hear something. It's mom, screaming. I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from my parents' room. I go closer. And closer. Mom? Dad? Please don't. Oh God. Mommy? Daddy? Oh God. Okay. Isn't Mr. Midnight an important gameplay mechanic in this game? I seem to recall that. Fran, please follow my voice. On the count of three, you will wake up. Oh, is this like a therapy session? One, two, three. Yeah, three. Fran, how do you feel? I feel like dying. Oh, does this does this game work better with a controller? It probably does, but I'm fine, I guess. I'm fine, I guess. Just had to see the same. Just sad to see the same things. Sadness is something everybody has within. I want to find the killer. I really want to know who killed my parents. The police are working on it. I'll find my cat and the killer. I'll find the killer and my cat. Your cat is missing. It would be impossible to get him back. But now I have something for you, Fran. What is it? See the desk? There's a package for you. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. 
Okay. This was my mother's purse. Okay. Open it. There's something inside. Alright, let's open up this thing here. Lost and found. Use, combine, examine. Use. I can't use this. Maybe I should examine it. Yeah. <laughs> combine it. <laughs> examine. Dearest Fran, here is the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remembered that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. <laughs> so I hope you'll always keep this purse and give it and all the other things you find a good use or good use. <laughs> Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift you have. Aunt Grace. She worried about you. Aunt Grace? Well, another reason to let me go. Well, don't worry about her. She is fine. Can I leave now? Can I go to my room now? Yes, you can leave. But before you go, it is time for your new medicine. What medicine or no new medicine? No more medicine. No more medicine. I don't want to try... <laughs> Wait, what, do, what voice do I give her? I've been giving her just a default feminine American voice. Do I give them British voices instead? I don't want to try more medicine. <laughs> it's called Duotine. It will make you feel very rel relaxed. Nurse, we're ready. Anything new today, Dr. Dern? Nothing, actually. Same visions as before. Oh, I see. Here, Fran, take your medicine. What if I don't? We don't have all day, Fran. Take the pills now. What if I walk over here instead? Is there anything else I can interact with? Does not look like it. Let's just go. <laughs> Grab it. I don't... I don't feel good. Oh god. Um... Oh no! Take her back to her room. And nurse, don't let her take this ever again. Oh god. I'm not gonna go with the British voice for everyone thing. Because <laughs> I don't have it. I don't have depth and complexity in my, in my voices. Beware, brave. Oh, beware, Fran Bo. If you leave the house of madness, I will hunt you down. Catch you. And bring you back to insanity. Fran, wake up. The medicine will help you escape. I'll be waiting for you in the forest. Oh, oh no, it's Mr. Midnight, isn't it? I love you. I forgot that it wasn't a female cat, it was a male cat. Chapter 1, My Sober Day. Oh? I'm still here. I'm still here. Hideous place. I have to get out of here. What is that? Oh, I see. Those are room changes. <laughs> I was like, what are these eyeballs? <laughs> What's this? Oh, sweet, sweet melody. One more time. La la la. It does the same as before, huh. Okay, I can't- nothing new comes of that. <laughs> Locked. Good reason to get curious. Alright, case that number. Franbo Dagenhart. Dagenhart. Age 10. Gender female. Patient was found near the Oswald Asylum showing signs of psychosis. The Bo Dagenhart family tragedy details omitted. Treatment. Dr. Marcel Dern, or Dern, has tried different medications and all have been cancelled because of side effects. Hmm. <laughs> I will get your nose. I will get it. Are you a happy clown? Can you make me laugh? 
Hopefully this won't fall on my head while I'm sleeping. Oh. <laughs> Red and... Timmy? You are hiding from me. I hate the monster. I am trying to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty. He hides because he is afraid. He told me that the medicine would show me where he is. Hmm. Those, those are like my diary entries, almost. Oh, holy moly, something fell! A handy hook. I'll save it to play pirate later. Use? On this. <laughs> Not sure what to do with this. Okay, wait, actually, before we go on, could I pick up this as well? Oh, I guess I broke the curtains. Now I can look outside. Oh, right. Uh-oh. Well, it was when I was looking outside last time that something bad happened. Tower defense. We have... Oh. Or is it def or is it defense tower? Um, I guess this, this is my way out. I don't think my head would fit through the window. Tower defense. We have you a crazy person called Fran. <laughs> Alright. Let's go through here. What's this? My legs are just fine. Oh, brought it up. Um, not so easy to see through this. Is that the playground? Empty bottle, empty glasses, nothing useful. Towels? Towels? I don't need towels. <laughs> I don't think I need any of this. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, I want to know what she's writing. I'm curious. Okay, let's talk to the nurse. Oh, Fran, you're awake. Good. Uh, how long was I asleep? Three days, maybe. Whoa. Was it the medicine? Was it the medicine that made me sleepy? Yes, it was the medicine. That's why you are not talk taking it anymore. Something happened. Oh, I forgot. Something happened. See? You are nothing but trouble. What is it? Uh... Broke the curtains? I was trying to ho look outside and I accidentally broke the curtains. <sighs> accidentally? I have to fix this. Follow me. Okay, wait, if I... Okay. Okay. Better go and talk to her. Damn it, I was like, <laughs> can I steal something from a desk now? Something is missing. Have you seen the hook that holds the curtains up? Uh... What's a hook? See nothing. No, miss. I haven't seen anything. Well, I have to go and find something to fix this. You little girl. Okay, wonderful. Let's go through here and let's rifle through a desk. <laughs> Ooh, band-aid? Oh, I'll keep these patches to stop blood. Ah. Uh... The patient has been sleeping almost all the time. She only wakes up to drink water, but I don't think she remembers that. After drinking, she goes to sleep again. She hasn't been so social for three days now. Some kids have come around and asked about her and when she would come out and play. Okay. Well, the trauma can have a great impact on children. Right, yes, yeah, so that's... Let me see. Traumas. Hmm. Trauma is a word the doctors love to say. <laughs> that brain looks like a turtle. Hmm. The nurse's handwriting is awful. Yeah, I, I really struggled with it. The only I only understand three words. Fran, sleeping, and duotine. Oh. Okay. Maybe that's a... Is that a medicine of so, some sort? Ew. What's this? Hide. I think this is where the medicine is, but it's locked. Oh my goodness, this is terrible. Why would the nurse have this? She wants to kill us all? I'll leave it as it was. I really need to get out of this place. Can I close the drawer then? Okay, it closes automatically. Okay. Examine. My pills are inside, I know it. I have to crack the code. Tiny patches to cure wounds. Yeah, okay, those will be items for, like, if I get hurt during the game. 
uh, I can heal my wounds. I could still walk around it and see what's on the other side. Oh, right, I, so I just... Okay. <laughs> oh? I hope somebody... I hope somebody loves you. Oh, oh, a secret box. Shh. Examine. A little box. It's open. Oh. A key! This will certainly open something. Combine with this box. No, um... <laughs> okay. Uh... Was there a... Was there a box that had a key hole? No, the box that I... box I picked up was the thing that had the key in it. Fillmore Bronstone. Eight male. Okay, so he's... Oh, poor Phil. I understand why you wouldn't trust them. Yeah. I used to have a blue dress like yours. I can't play with you now. I'm on a very secret mission. Hello, Phil. Hello. Uh, how are you? Everybody says that I'm sick. I have to find- <laughs> I have to find Kitty now, bye. They're just stupid. They always say that. Are you leaving tonight? I will if you help me, or I'll try and find- okay. I will if you help me. The only thing I know is that the office is the, is the key. There's a key inside? Oh, there's a key inside? The key! Is there a key inside the office? I saw the doctor write a secret code. A secret code? To open the yellow door. He doesn't want me to tell you. Who? Him. Oh. I see. All doors are closed. You are my prisoner. You are prisoner of my games. And nobody will help you escape. Leave me alone. I hate you. Oh? Mommy? Daddy? I need you so much right now. Well... <laughs> no, I won't let that monster stop me. So, that was a fruitless discussion, I guess. Oh, wooden Mr. Horse. Are you having a good time? Back and forth. <laughs> if I sit down, I will eventually get up. So what's the point? <laughs> Interesting. Interesting way to think about it. A bed. <laughs> it just says a bed, nothing else. Okay, uh, I thought the code might be for this. Well, let's go through here. Of course it's locked. Okay. Combine. Combine the key. With... No, wait, don't combine it, sorry. <laughs> Use the key. With this. The key is too tiny. Oh. What's the key for then? Oh, this this one here. Maybe that? Yes. Yes, yes. I got it. And there's something inside. Oh. Uh, examine. Oh, this is our family, I guess. And one of this will probably be our auntie. Our aunt, Grace. Oh, wait. Uh, let's actually look at it. I forget that when you examine it, it doesn't like... You don't have to click on it to make her say something. Oh, my dear family. I'll guard this with my life. Uh, examine this. My hair clip. I should give it a use. Um, I'm not sure what I'd use the hair clip on. Oh. Ah, the playground. Good night, trees and moon. I'm pretty sure the playground isn't a good escape route. Okay. Didn't actually look at my bed. I don't want to. I just woke up. <laughs> I wasn't asking you to sleep in it. Okay, let's talk to Phil again. Did you find the doctor's code yet? It's in the office. I'm assuming this is the office, but it's locked. Uh, combine with this, maybe? Oh, wait, there's more text here. I miss you so much. I really need you here with me. I will find my kitty and then go to you, Aunt Grace. I know Aunt Grace will take good care of me and Mr. Midnight. I wish my parents were alive. Yeah. Ah, the shape- Oh, the- 
Of course, I could probably use this on the door, pick my way in. It fits, but there are two holes, I need something else. Uh, use this? No, that shape's not right. Can I combine these? It won't do. Am I already stuck? <laughs> Am I already like... What the hell do I do? Oh, oh shit, okay. Uh, I went to go use- I was just clicking on everything. Went to go use this hide. Uh... Hmm... I haven't seen any four lit up four number of codes, have I? Maybe there's a date on my- my report? 1944, maybe? No. It's gotta be a clue. Oh! H8. Hide. So eight nine four th five is it? Eight nine four five. Nine four five. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank God there was a little hint there, and like the duo team, the not the yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was good. That was actually good. That was super difficult to find though. Like just to figure out, I because I didn't realize if I hit. Use if I clicked it and hit use, it would come up with a special view of it. Um, but yeah, I have pills now. Do I use the pills somehow? And oh dear, why are you looking at me like that? You terrify me. Bill is playing with his uncle, and his uncle is mad. Mad. Um... Oh. Hello? Oh no, your head! I'll try to put your head back on. I'm sorry, I can't help you, Mr. Deer. Okay, I can't... You can see. Ah, uh, to happiness. Of course it's locked. What is that black thing, black thing sitting next to you? Okay, so, oh. Oh dear. Who did it? It was not me. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not convinced that Fran didn't kill her own parents. Blood. Find him. Very upset, demon. Draw is empty. <laughs> the melody is still sweet. Oh, are you sleeping, sweet bunny? Well. Oh, is that my head? Give me my head, please. Just go away, you weird creatures. <laughs> hmm. Oh dear. Uh, not the window. Hello, Miss Nurse. Are you all right? Watch your step, it says. You got a little blood on your mouth. Are you okay? Get out, creepy creature. What are you, huh? Tell me. Okay, let's just bite the bullet and go down here. No, absolutely not. You can't tell her that. But she has to know. You can't keep me away from her. The reason is more than clear, Grace. Grace? <laughs> no, it's not. I want to take her home now. You can't. Fran's mental condition is not appropriate yet. Oh. Was that real? Oh, dear Aunt Grace. I wonder what she has to tell me. That doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight. Oh, my bed is now back to where it was before. 
Oh no, Foxy Fox, don't cry. Aw, use my hand as a tissue. Would you like a hug? Foxy, why are you so sad? God. Hmm. Okay, that hasn't changed. Oh wait, there's a there's a ball of yarn on the floor. Excuse me, lady nurse. Uh, this may be very useful. Yeah, okay, so I needed the knitting needle. So I have knitting needle plus my bobby pin, maybe? Might be what I need. Combine with this. Yeah, there we go. Ah, oh, fantastic. My very own special key. Use it on the door. Yes, to happiness. Oh, dear. What was that? Daddy was not there. Mummy would not care. If I take the... Oh, okay. Oh, I can activate it and deactivate it at will. You're my beloved friend. Bip, bip, boom. <laughs> okay, let's just turn that off. <laughs> so that's going to be the main feature, I'm assuming. Uh, the maze. We never get to play there. Oh, tonight the fog is pretty thick. Oh, the perfect day to to sneak out then. Hmm. Oh, let me see. A red puppet and a serpent. A teddy and many other things. Who's this? Hello. You see them. You do, right? What? See what? The creatures that follow everyone. The shadows? You mean the shadows? Uh-huh. I can't see them, but I know they're there. You know what they are? Well, do you know what they are? Yeah, I guess. Tell me, please. <laughs> you like to draw? I like to draw. I, lo I love to draw. I love it too. Yes, I love it too. But tell me more about the shadows. Crayon. A crayon. I want to find a crayon. I want to draw. I draw all the time. I want to find my cat. Well, I want to find my cat. Draw a cat if you don't have one. I could. I could draw my I could draw my cat, but I'd rather find him. Your cat is in danger. The shadows took him, I know. Who told you that? It's gonna be him. The one that follows me. Bye. Oh. No. Okay, if I take this. I talk to this. You should blame yourself. Be quiet. Why do you look like a fabric doll? What have they done to you? He takes away your innocent inner child and devours it. Nobody believes you, although the wounds are bleeding. Alrighty, well. Tiny, tiny hands all over. You eating your soul. Even the purest of things die in this place. I don't want to touch it. It's the clown from the painting. Please stop. <laughs> See, even the flowers died. Oh, it's this clown. Oh, real flowers. They smell so sweet. Uh, victim of sexual abuse by an unknown person. This bed is very pink. Oh, this one of those... Mute clowns. I've seen so many, and they all look sad. This one is very happy, though. Good for him. That's mine, my crayons. Can I have it? I just like this green crayon so much. Can I have it? No, I won't be able to draw green then. That's ridiculous. But you have so many. Oh, that's true, but you have so many other colors. Yes, many colors, but you know, they don't like me drawing. Who? Who? The nurses. They tie me up. And when I want to draw, I can't. They are crazy. The nurses are crazy. When I can't draw, I hurt myself. Then comes the red milk. Look. Oh, God. Oh, I hate it. Please cure me. Yes, and stop the red milk. I'll see what I can do. Oh. Well, on that horrifically sad note, let's uh let's leave this here. <laughs>
<laughs> I hate, oh, that's, that's terrible, that's awful. I'm hoping that this game auto saves. I don't know if it does. I might need to talk to the girl again, but uh, other than that, we should be up to this point here. So, I'm looking forward to this. I actually, I've heard great things about this game, and I want to do some spooky, freaky stuff for Halloween. So I thought this would be a perfect opportunity to play this, and then I can play Little Miss Fortune shortly after. <laughs> but whatever the case, if you like what you saw, hit like. If you want to see more from me, then subscribe. A whole lot more Franbo coming right up. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, and until next time.